Hello, I'm Ty Mason of the DiabetesCouncil.com, a researcher, writer, and I have type 2 diabetes. Today I'm going to answer the question, is Yakult good for diabetes? But before we get into that, make sure you download my free diabetes management book, which also includes a diabetes grocery shopping guide, foods to eat and avoid, by clicking the link below. Once again, I find myself researching a product that I've never heard of before. Yakult is a probiotic drink. It is made from fermenting skim milk with a bacteria called Lactobacillus cassii shirata, or LCS. One might think with the probiotic craze of recent years that this drink is relatively new, but one would be wrong. Yakult was developed in 1935 by a Japanese scientist Minoru Shirota, who was a 1930 graduate of the medical school of Kyoto University. Now, Yakult was first sold outside Japan and Taiwan in 1965 when many Japanese immigrants in Brazil wanted the drink. Today, it is sold in 35 countries. So what is in this drink? Well, there's sugar in the form of sucrose and dextrose, skimmed milk powder, natural flavors, Live Lactobacillus cassii shiroto strain of bacteria, 6.5 billion per 65 milliliter bottle, and water. Now there are also 14 grams of sugar per 100 milliliters of Yakult. By comparison, Coca-Cola, not Diet Coke, regular Coke, has 10 grams of sugar per 100 milliliters. A 2007 study of the probiotic Lactobacillus cassii found in dahi, or yogurt, found that in diabetic rats, a dahi-supplemented diet significantly delayed the onset of glucose intolerance, hyperglycemia, hyperinsulinemia, and oxidative stress in high fructose-induced diabetic rats, indicating a lower risk of diabetes and its complications. But that was a yogurt product. However, a 2011 study actually obtained the exact strain of bacteria used in Yakult and concluded this study suggests that LCS has the potential to prevent obesity-associated metabolic abnormalities by improving insulin resistance. Again, we aren't exactly sure how the LCS was introduced in this study, but it did help in reducing insulin resistance. However, it must also be pointed out that this study was conducted by the Food Research Department of the Yakult Central Institute for Microbiology Research. Yes, the makers of Yakult. So, with 12 carbs, 11 grams of sugar per 65 milliliter bottle, is Yakult good for diabetes? Surprisingly, yes. The GI of Yakult is just 46, the GL is just 6, plus the probiotic benefits of the drink far outweigh the small impact it might have on your blood sugar. If you don't like the sugar or dairy factor, there are many probiotics in capsule form. You can also eat yogurt, sauerkraut, or kimchi, which are all great sources of the natural probiotic bacteria. I hope this answered your question, is Yakult good or bad for diabetes? Don't forget to get your diabetes management book by clicking the link in the description box below. And as always, let me know if you have any other diabetes-related questions. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Ty Mason.